Let me tell you a story. There once upon a time was a man who not through doubt and misfortune, but rather through good times and pleasure, came to the conclusion that life wasn't worth living. So he went out to buy a revolver. On his way, a great clamor arose in the street. A house caught fire, and in a moment was in flames. Suddenly, at one of the windows in the top story, there appeared a woman. The firemen placed their highest ladders against the building, and a man began to climb up. That man was none other than a candidate for suicide. He took the woman out of the window and gave her to the firemen, then went into the house. You can't have power for good without having power for evil. Even a mother's milk nourishes murderers as well as heroes. This power which tears men's bodies to pieces, never so horribly abused as the intelligent power, the imaginative power, the poetic, reisic power that enslaves men's souls. As a teacher of Greek, I gave the intelligent man weapons against the common man. I now want to give the common man weapons against the intelligent man. I love the common people.